first and foremost, we own a coffee shop in downtown Carbonair. We have a boutique uh, with that as well, and we represent uh, over 35 local artists and artisans in our boutique. And uh, we also run an art school and gallery. I get my inspiration everywhere, every day. I kind of feel sometimes like I steal the good off others. I wake up every day and I watch the sunrise and I feel really good to greet my family and then to go on to the next part of my day. I guess it's what drives me and motivates me every day. It's an internal, personal drive that I have. The driving force is to, you know, kind of get to that end result that we look for. I don't really know how to do anything else. I think the other aspect of our success is the ability to um, change on a dime. I think that's the only reason for our success being in rural Newfoundland. So my strength as an entrepreneur comes from home. It also comes from my business partner. My team is family. I can't do what I do without them. Absolutely not. Well, life gets really busy. I decided very early on that teaching is still very important to me and it's just really complemented each other really well. My advice to anyone thinking about becoming an entrepreneur is do your due diligence. Really be eyes wide open uh, when you're looking into, you know, really putting forward yourself, your finances, all of that. Just having that mindset of it was going to work right from the get-go, I think helped us uh, a lot. Downtown Carbonier, when it wasn't the brightest spot to be in, you know, but we believed that our community would, would follow us and support us, and they have. So winning this award has really been um, a, an eye-opening and humbling experience. To have our peers recognize that really, really means a lot to me. After we hung up the phone, it was sort of, it was sinking in. We thought, yeah, Ooh, yeah. yeah.